All right, guys, we are at the lake. We're at Powerton Lake. I'm the only car in the parking lot so far. It's uh, it's like March 9th, March 10th. It's a Thursday. And uh, they're pumping. I cannot believe it. I cannot believe it. I just came thinking they weren't going to be, but but they are. You never know. I drove three hours here. So um, we got bait. I got, I got frozen bait today, so I don't know how that's going to go. Um, but... We're gonna get out of here, gonna make this long walk. If you look, way down there, we gotta make about a, I don't know, a mile walk. It, it's good for you, it's good exercise. So, we get out here, and hopefully, the conditions seem to be good. So, overcast, there's some snow coming in later, and uh, maybe that'll fire these fish up. You never know, but we get out here, I'll show you the setup, and we'll get to fishing, see if we can catch a giant. Um, there are some giants in this lake, so let's see what we could do. See you out there. Got a brand new wagon, guys. The other one, wheel broke off in like three trips, so it's going to be an easy walk, hopefully. All right, guys, we're going to start this journey. There's only two other guys, so I think I can pretty much fish anywhere I want. We got a north wind today it should be blowing into the discharge so even though all the conditions are perfect that doesn't mean hey shut up geese doesn't mean that I'm gonna catch them like I said I do not have good bait I mean I don't even have confidence in it but see if I can get anything fresh over here maybe I can catch a few bluegills or something and uh, we'll see what happens. I just kind of want you guys to understand how much work goes into fishing here in Illinois. I mean, you really got to grind to get big fish. You really have to. Um, and that's what I like is big fish, so I'll do the grind. You know? Uh, we, we, we do what we got to to catch them, so. This place has some giants in it the, the downside is everybody fishes here so these fish have been hooked over and over you know some of them are very smart and they won't even they won't take your bait unless they're absolutely starving and you put it in the absolute perfect place so that's why the long surf rods help but i've been uh, surprised coming here before where i came and thought it was going to be a horrible bite and caught 13 fish you know so it can it can treat you well and it can also send you home sad especially when gas is five dollars a gallon and you got to drive three hours so it's a little perspective on what we do to catch these fish some of us so I'll be there in about 15 minutes I'm a pretty fast walker pretty pretty fit guy Got a new wagon, you know. All right, guys, so we made it. And uh, I'm going to get set up. I'm going to show you what I'm doing. I'm, I'm fishing a current seam here. They're running this plant. There's a current seam about 100 yards out there. And that's where I generally like to uh, have my bait. It seems like the fish will sit there and run that and, uh, and grab whatever, whatever they can. I mean, that's how I've caught in the bigger fish. Um... So here's what we got here. This is a 12 footer. Got the 12 footers out here. We ain't fishing in the, in the boat today because I just felt like with the conditions, they would be, uh, they would be whatever over here. <clears throat> One of my favorite cuts of bait is this tail piece. And the reason is, is it's very aerodynamic, bloody, and I can throw them very far. So that's going to be our first bait. Throw it on here. It's a 12 watt Dale's tackle hook. That carp does not come off the hook. There it goes. Here we go. This one's going to be further out over here because it's got a lighter sinker on it. <laughs> I 
and I hit it. I hit where I needed to be, so. And now it's a waiting game. You guys know the waiting game, right? Got one, guys. <laughs> he smoked it, too. Took a pretty good one. It's a pretty good fish. Alright, we're on the board, boys. Man. Let's get down there and get him. Settle down there, bud. That was on a small chunk, but that fish absolutely annihilated it, guys. Here we go. Fish number one's about a 15 pounder. Nice and fat, too. Let's see if we can get another one. It's a good move, man. I moved down because Getting no hits. Here you go, buddy. Got him. This is number two. No giants yet, but that's another decent one. Number two, another decent fish, guys. It's not a bad one. It's over 10, probably. There we go. It's biting funny today. Not really hammering it. Be able to get a giant before the day is over. I'll put a little bit bigger of a bait out there. See if we can get a big dog to eat.
All right, guys, here we go. Got two big baits out there now. They left me nothing but skin on there. Definitely eating funny. I mean, I don't know. Hopefully one hammers it. It's my favorite part. That should be good fish, guys. That one hammered it. Should be a decent one. Three o'clock. That's a really good fish. See if we can land her. That's a good one. So we were looking for. Come here, Biggie. That's a good fish, guys. He's jumping. That's probably about 30, 35, something like that. Got some water on the camera. All right. It's the fish I was looking for all day. Probably about a 30, 30 something. Real good looking fish though. Smoked it. That was fun. Let's let him go. I think we're gonna end it on that one. It's a good day. Really good day. One more look, just in case. 
you know. Ah, big dog. He's pissed. Just chilling. He smoked that bait though. All right guys, last piece of bait. We got 20 minutes left. It's not a big piece. I don't know why, it just seems like right at the end of the day, these fish want to start eating. I haven't gotten a fish bigger than probably about 15, 20 pounds. And then all of a sudden, he ate. We're just gonna throw this out for good luck. Fifteen minutes left. Let's see what happens. We just got a giant, guys. This one's like a 50, I think. Yeah, that's a giant. He ain't done. How are we gonna get this fish, guys? It's like a 60.
the tank daddy That is a giant, boys. It's every bit of 60. About, boys. Look at that thing. All right, ready? Here we go. Probably a 60 pounder. What a day. That's going to end it. We got to get back to the car. Let's go. Here he goes. Oh my God. All right, that's it guys, we gotta go. Hope you enjoyed that video. Stay tuned for what's to come.